Hi everyone, and this is Andy with Blong.com. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to create a button in Zoho CRM that will send text messages to any phone field we choose using SMS magic. I have linked in the description a blog post where you can find the written tutorial as well as more information that we will use in this video. All right, let's get started. This is the second video I made on the SMS magic and Zoho CRM integration. In the first video, I showed how to configure the SMS Magic extension, and we also sent our first message. Here's how it works. First, select one or multiple contacts that have a phone number on the mobile field, then click on Send SMS. This will open the SMS Magic website where you can send the message. Just select the sender ID and type the message in this box. But this works with the mobile field and the contact. What if we want to send messages using a different field, like the phone field? Well, that's what we're gonna set up today. We're going to add a button here in the contacts profile in this area. So when you click on it, you will be able to send a text message to the phone field. All right, let's go to the setup and then to modules and fields. We are adding the button to the contacts module. So let's open that module. Now go to the links and buttons tab. Here we can see that we already have a button. This one was created automatically by the SMS Magic extension. Let's add a new button. The name is gonna be SMS to phone. And in this dropdown, we have to select where we're gonna be placing the button. Earlier, I showed you where I want to place it, which is the view page, but you have other options like the list view mass action menu. This is the same place where the button created by SMS Magic is. Okay, let's select view page. Now we have to choose the action that this button will perform. Let's choose invoke URL. In this new box, we have to add the URL we want to invoke. So let's go to our SMS Magic account. This is the getting started tab where we're gonna click on button configuration. Here we have to choose our module, which is contacts. And for the phone field, we're gonna choose phone. If you have other phone fields like work phone, they should be listed here as well. All right, let's click on generate send SMS URL. This is the URL, so let's select it and copy it. And back to the CRM, let's paste the URL on the box. And now we're gonna save it. And the button has been created. On the right, we can see that only administrators will be able to use this button. If you want to change permissions, just hover over the button and click on set permissions. Okay, let's go to the contact module. And we're gonna open this contact. On the top right corner, we can see that the button we just created is there. When clicked, it will send text messages to the number in the phone field of this contact. Let's test it out. Just click on the button and the SMS Magic app will open. Select the sender ID, type the message in the text box and click on send. In this box, click on send. All right, the message has been sent. We're gonna go back to Zoho CRM so I can show you the messages on the contacts profile. Go to the contacts module and open the contact we just sent the message to. On the left, click on SMS history. These are all the messages we sent and received related to this contact but we can customize this panel to see more information. Let's click on this icon and unselect email. Let's add the sender ID, the text, and the sent status. Click on save. And now we can see the number that sent or received the messages, the message itself, and the status. On the first column, notice that the name says either out or in. This is the message direction. If we sent the message, it will start with out. And if we receive the message, it will start with in. Feel free to add more columns or remove them with this icon. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, please click the like button. Also check out the other SMS magic videos we have on this channel. If you're a Zoho admin and would like to learn more about how to integrate the different Zoho apps, we created a Zoho One class where you're gonna learn how to configure and integrate the top 10 most useful Zoho One apps. Check out the link in the description for more information. Thanks for watching.